Hockey Night in New England. It comes your way live from Bell Center in Montreal, Quebec, where tonight the Bruins make their first visit to this shrine of hockey to take on the Montreal Canadiens. After it, but Schlemko gets the return and then spanks it right back to Jordy Ben. Corrali on the forecheck, making Ben's passing lane disappear. Here's Backus on the steal. He scores! David Backus with his first of the season, picking it clean and rifling it past Carey Price. And you can see Gary Price is reading that. He's gearing up, maybe for the blocker. And all of a sudden, it's on the glove side right by him. Cruz setting up four on four here. Cruz into the middle to Dabrowski, scores! Jake Dabrowski gives the Bruins insurance. This Tory is Krug just, he's, his ability to read. Took the words right out of my mouth, Jack. This is what Tory Krug gives you in a four on four. But Krug was below the goal line early in the shift, much of the shift, then he works his way up the half wall. Krejci drifts into that high slot and opens up a little bit of a seam, and DeBrus beats his man. Saucer pass to Schlemko, that hits Gallagher in front. The swoop by Agostino slides it past the post. It deflects off the Wagner stick. Schlemko's drive will not count. Will not count. Russ punches it to Krejci, off the boards to Crew, to Pasternak in the circle, to Laurier nearby, Pasternak cross ice to Krejci, back to Crew, Crew to Krejci, the shot club saved by Price. Krug sells the shot, goes right back to Krejci, and as Krejci surveys his option, he lets that drag snapshot go, try to beat Price shortstop. To Victor Mete, right in front, Rass makes the save and holds his line, and then the puck ends up in the goal, and Rask is irate. The signal on the ice is good goal, and considering how many times we have seen situations like this in the last half dozen games, whistle dead immediately as soon as the referee loses sight of the puck. I think Rask has an argument here. But and the goal got question after the whistle. We'll go. There you go. Carl Walsner to Jonathan Truan. Truan speeds into the Boston zone. Goes around Krug. The shot saved by Rask. And it wiggles in. Andrew Shaw goes into the crease. I think it's going to be Truan's goal. The shot is going to be handled by Rask. Rides up his body. Shaw gets his stick in there. I don't know if he gets a piece of it or not. He camouflages it well. Schlemko turns his goal, gives way to Agostino. Goes home with the poke check on Tatar. Shaw in front, the score! Thomas Tatar ties it! When you get three caught deep, killing a penalty. Lozon's back there, he was on the short side. He went back there to try to make on the play on the puck when Grizzly was back there. To time again, finds open space in the scoring area. And it's a beautiful high shot under the crossbar. Jonathan Joanne nutmegs Corral. Shaw. Well, what's going on here? David Backus is down way, way away from the play. As that play developed, it was Drew with a high stick on Backus. The Bruins got a great advantage right here now with 5.21 to go. Matt Grizzly. Five on three and a half here. Shaw without the stick. Krejci all the way through. Moore shoots and scores! John Moore puts the Bruins ahead with less than three to go. It's his first goal as a Bruin. Danton Heinen goes in deep. Moore comes in behind him. And before Petrie can get in the shooting lane, before Price can get back up and seal off the short side, he buries it. Drouin with 10 seconds to go. Achari to Nordstrom. He sends it out. Drouin, go cry in the shower. The Bruins win 3-2 at Bell Center. Dale, as we said when we began our coverage tonight, there are never too many Bruins-Canadiens games. I wish there were more on the schedule.